hope you had a wonderful holiday season. I had a beautiful holiday that I've spent with my friends and family. During the winter solstice, we had our first snow. And on Christmas Day, we had a real snowstorm. Mother Nature is very kind to us. As global warming is not a myth, but a real problem our humanity is facing, we are very lucky to have snow. Many of you know this coffee-based dessert. I prepared it as a birthday cake. This one turned to be very, very delicious. Tiramisu is easy to prepare as it doesn't need to be baked and as a coffee lover I enjoy it with a cup of coffee in the morning. As winter time has come, days are shorter, colder, 
people always wanted to bring the light, light a candle, make a fireplace. During the holidays, we can see lights all around the world in different cultures. Candles are an important part of a number of holiday celebrations. They are represented in both religious and non-religious winter holidays. People interpret their meaning in many different ways. Some associate candles with the Yuletide. The winter solstice celebrations date back for centuries. Celebrators think the warm glow of candles shows spring is on its way. Others view candles as a feminist guiding light. This comes from several ancient traditions. Christians equate candles with the guiding star of a Bethlehem. Jews light the Hanukkah during Hanukkah. During Kwanzaa, the central symbol is a candelabra of special colored candles. The winter solstice was celebrated throughout the ancient pagan world and included Greek and Roman festivals. The sun provided light and warmed the earth. Its gradual disappearance each fall caused great concern. Each year our ancestors worried that maybe this year the sun would not return. Consequently, their solstice celebrations used lots of lights in an attempt to lure back the sun. Anyone who celebrated Christmas as a child knows the basic pagan Yule customs. These are preserved as the secular Christmas traditions and include the burning of lights and the bringing of evergreen decorations into our homes. Green fur pine or holly represent living plant life preserved during the dark season that began at Samhain. Their presence in our home visually expresses a hope and longing for the regreening of nature in the spring. You celebrate a traditional pagan Yule when you place candles in the windows decorate a Christmas tree with lights, use decorations of holy and mistletoe, sing singular seasonal songs, feast with friends, and give gifts to loved ones. All these customs originated with Yule celebrations that predated Christianity.